Hi, it's Cat at Matt, and today I am doing a speed paint where I draw all 50 people from daily sketches. If you don't know, I recently just did 50 days of doing a daily sketch of people in Blizzcord, link in the description to them. And now I'm gonna do it all over again, but digitally, and it's gonna be on this one picture right here. Now, when I do draw it, I had I did like go up and do stuff, but at the end, I put it all back in. And now we'll start off with day one, El Pass. Now, El Pass is pretty cool. I met him in VC where I was like, hot. You have a raccoon motif to your character. I'ma draw a raccoon. And that was the first time we ever met, is like me just drawing him a random raccoon for no reason. And from that, we kept hanging out, and now he's a good friend to me. The X guy. So I actually met the X guy in VC. He was trying to get into Blizzcord, and he was making a video to audition for that. Sadly, he did not get in, but there was a lot of people rooting for him, and I was also one of the people rooting for him, but also messing with him. And we had a joke about me being like, ah, I hope you don't get in, <laughs> just to mess with him. Uh, but he's a lot of fun. He's, he goofs around a lot. Uh, comic fake. So my first interaction with the comic fake actually is me and him getting into a argument about what is art block. Because he w was like, oh, you're going to get art block from drawing this much. And I'm like, nah, you don't understand. I'm addicted to art. I can never get art block. And he's like, that's, that's not how it works. But I'm like, oh. But it is how it works, is I've actually not really gotten art blocked for more than like a week at most. Chris46. So Chris46, I also met from VCing with people just in Blizzcord. And he's a lot of fun. He'll like tease, when he's born, he'll like tease me like, oh, I'm going to show and reveal my face. But then he doesn't. My favorite joke with him is that, ah, they don't call me Crystal PvP for no reason. Making fun of his name. Chris 46 and Crystal PvP. It was a fun little pun made just off the spot. Corwick! Corwick, I also met in VC, VCing with people. One day I just decided I was gonna sketch people in VC, and he was one of the people that I sketched, and he's like, oh my god, you're so cool! So we just started hanging out a lot more in VC, and I've drawn him more than once now because of that, because I'll just get bored and I'll just start drawing. And he'll be like, ooh, draw my character. And I'm like, sure. So he's a lot of fun and, and very goofy. Redstone Boy. So Redstone Boy is like the X guy where I met him in VC and he was trying to audition to get in Bliss. He was the other person that everybody was rooting for to be like, oh, he's going to join. He's going to join. He ended up not joining. But... He's very fun to hang out with. He's also kind of ridiculous like the X guy. However, his skills are more in coding stuff, which is really cool. And yeah, he's a uh, he's fun and he's cool. And I joined the SMP for day. Ronautics. So Ronautics, I also joined <laughs> met him through VCing with people. I've met a lot of people through VCing in Discord. And he is very goofy. He likes to make a lot of jokes all the time, like 24-7. If the joke doesn't happen, he just kind of leaves the VC. He's like, nah, I'm done. He's got. He's like perpetually going for the jokes, um, which is a lot of fun. It's always entertaining when he's in VC to like listen and stuff when I'm drawing. So I rather enjoy him. CJ. So CJ, uh, actually, after I did the daily sketch, he messaged me. was like, hey, could your art is really cool would you draw something for me? And I'm like, sure, why not? And I actually ended up drawing him a thumbnail. That's how happy he was with the artwork. He used it as a thumbnail for a video he made that was like an hour long. And then I joined a watch party for that video. And that was really cool getting to meet him and hang out with some mutual friends there. Penguin. So I met Penguin in VC, uh, the same as Corwick, where I was just drawing random people and I drew him. And my first interaction with him is making a derp version of his character and him being like, listen, I know I'm derpy, but like, why you gotta draw me like that? <laughs> that was very fun. And uh, I liked messing around with him because he was very uh, express expressive. Flynora. So Flynora 
is a furry. That's the joke in the Discord right now because his character is a cat. And uh, he doesn't like to admit it, but his character is literally just a cat. So we all make fun of him for it. But he's really cool. He uh, He's a moderator on Blitzcord, actually. But um, he like speed ran to moderator because he started as a junior moderator. And he was just so consistent that they're like, oh, now nah, we got to give it to him. All right. Gapple. So Gapple is really cool because I actually met him by asking to join his server, which was going to be completely non-modded. And then it failed and it went to somebody else. But it was like, but he invited all of us to go to the new server, which was really nice of him. He didn't have to do that. So that was really cool of him. All right. Alex Slayer. Alex Slayer, I met actually on the new server from Gapple. I didn't really know him that much previously. He al he's always like talked a lot in the chats, but I've never really interacted with him. And me and him have recently interacted a lot on this new server that we started. And it has been a blast. I always mess with him because he'll make a bunch of risque jokes. So I'll draw him risque and he'll be like, Cat, please stop. And I'm like, stop with the jokes. And he's like, never. Uh, all right, mixed, mixed. I met through VCing and Blizzcord. Um, he knew people like the X guy, Redstone boy, um, Ronatix, Corwick, Chris. So I kind of know him through that, and I'm just like, ah, I VC'd with this person before. Let's draw him. Why not? Uh, he's also one of the people that I've like doodled and like I've drawn him more than once before. So I'm like, eh, might as well. I mean. Uh, Spiral. So Spiral is another artist, and I love their artwork. It's it's a sketch version of art, and it's so cool because they know how to use like lighting and stuff. So like they always have like a a gray background or something in their art, and it just looks so cool and works so well that I'm always like, oh yes, this is amazing. So like. I'm like, ooh, I need to get this person to be drawn because they're just they're just too cool not to be. Johono. So a lot of people know Johono in Blizzcord because he was actually previously a part of it, but then he got kicked off. And um, I'm like friends of friends of people with him. So I'm like, ah, you you need drawn. You're you're too a part of Blizzcord to not be drawn in here. So I drew him, and everybody on that day like just made fun of him <laughs> on that for some reason. I don't know why they made fun of him on that picture, but they did. So, oh well. Corner. This one's a joke one because Corner, his name is Corner. So obviously he's a corner, right? At, he does actually have like an actual Minecraft skin and stuff, but I asked him literally, can I just draw a corner? Cause your name is Corner. And he's like, you know what? That is such a great idea. Now you have to do it. And that is the whole entire reason why he's just a corner. And it's a detailed corner because he's got layers. Ha ha ha. Very intelligent, kind of. Karai. So Karai is like best friends with corner and corner's best friends with Karai. And I'm like, hey, what? I want to draw you. And Karai's like, uh, all I have are female Minecraft skins. And I'm like, I don't care. It's still a character. And he's like, oh, okay. And then I drew it and then I gave him a gun and the daily sketch and he like freaked out. He's like, corner, guess what I need at all times now? And corner's like, why did you do this cat? And it was really funny. Snug time. So Snug time has like kind of like a similar art style to me, but it's like more simplistic, but not. And it, it's cool. I like it. It works. And, um, well, we haven't compared art. I've always compared my art to his because I'm like, ooh. We're similar. I wanna I wanna push forward. He's like a motivator for me. I wanna I wanna be able to to get better at art because of him. So yeah. Ryzen. So Ryzen is another moderator on Blizzcord. So you'll see him talk a lot. He's he's in the chats and stuff a lot of the time. And he's cool. He's chill. He's fun. And the reason why I drew him actually is because uh, a friend of his, uh L Luminescent, uh she drew a picture of him and I'm like, oh, I should probably draw him. That's that that should be a person I should draw. And then I drew him. That's the only reason why he's here. 
I do hacks. I kept seeing him in like the chats. He's typically in like more of like the specific chats, not really like the. He's in general, but like you see him a lot on like uh, possible gym ideas and stuff on like things to create and work on, which it is cool. I think that's cool that he's like consistently trying to think of new stuff and do new things. So he he's a he's a he's a cool cat. He's got a cool thing. Although his character is ridiculous, and I think it's hilarious. All right, Jeffrey, Jeffrey. All right, Jeffrey's the guy who made the the new server that Gapo joined. And I'm like, at first, I'm like, who is this guy? I mean, hey, I want to join a server, so I guess I'm just going with this. And but after I got to know him some more, I'm like, oh, he's he's pretty fun. He's cool. And then he ended up joining in on the joke that I have with Alex Lair, because he would bounce off of Alex Lair a lot of the time. T4. So I met T4 actually on Capital. That's how I know him. Because I... I well, there's this whole entire story here. Because Corwick made me join Capital, and then I drew a th few things for Capital because of Corwick. And then I got into, like, the Capital Special Week, and then I met T4 because I paired up with another friend, Nico, who isn't in here. And we, <laughs> and we temporarily joined T4's team just to betray it, but it failed? Anyway. Nebula Dust Phoenix. Now, I always see Nebula Dust Phoenix with stug time stuff in fact they did like an art trade thing which was cool and they like have really thick outlines i don't know why and i'm like that's different i don't know how i feel about it still even though i've seen more than one artwork of it not saying it's bad i'm just like what because <laughs> it's just so thick but it's really cool uh subtical dude th this person has asked me and just in general has asked anyone to like please draw fan art of him dude is desperate for any art at all that is my only interaction with him i know like i he's he was uh on capital so i like i talked with him and stuff for that one week but like the only reason i'm doing this was because he just kept asking for free art and i'm like i'm doing daily sketches i can draw you in it you're in discord blue bin Blue Ben is kind of like uh, I do hacks and some other people where he's just consistently in the chats and stuff and talks to people and hangs out with other people. So I'm like, hey, you need a drawing. You're too much a part of the group community to not get one. So that's kind of why I did him. He, his is like, his, his was hard to draw. Uh, it's Nights are difficult for me, but yeah. Base Q. Um, he recently rebranded, branded into just, uh, not chicken nugget, nugget, <laughs> just nugget from kindergarten, but with different clothing. I'm like, okay. And then he left Blizzcord and then I'm like, dude, please rejoin back. I drew this of you. And he's like, I can't say no to that, <laughs> which was really nice of him, uh, to rejoin back after I did that. So he's cool. Oh, Rhea. Rhea, I, I love their art. They are literally just the the Muggum artist. Muggum is a person actually in the Bliss SMP and Bliss Cord. Uh, but she is just, she's so good at drawing him. Like, nobody can compete. She she practically only draws him. Some, once in a blue moon, she'll draw someone else. But, like, she has him down so well. And I saw her, like, be like, oh, I love your art. And I'm like, oh, I have to draw you now just because of that. White Muggum. Now, I only did White Muggum after Reyna because his whole entire shtick is he's Muggum, but it's inversed colors, right? So Muggum's normally black. So he's like, oh, I'm going to be white. And he has a motif of color of red. So the other guy's like, ah, I'm going to have a motif of color of light blue because he didn't like how green worked. So he had to do light blue. It's just so ridiculous of a concept. I'm like, all right, buddy. Sure, you can join. Uh, Raid 16. So Raid 16, it, he's cool. He actually commissioned me. And I'm like, ah, you know what? You're in Blizzcord. And I I met you through VC in Blizzcord. So I'm going to draw you without telling you. So he was pleasantly surprised to get this sketch. And I'm really happy I was able to do it for him because he was kind of having like a hard time uh, when that happened. So there you go. Cat. Uh, 
So, Cat is so cool. I love their art so much. They make it's so detailed and well done. And I'm just like, oh, you're amazing at art. It's just so well made, especially on like digital art. I have such a hard time like making realistic people or like just areas and stuff. And she does such a good job with it. I feel like I'm like looking at a painting, even though it's digitally made. And it's just so well done. Life Rider. Life Rider is a mod on Blizzcord and he does mod things and talks sometimes and stuff. And he's like, he's actually like the second most talked person on Blizzcord right now. Like he talks way really too much in there. And like when I asked him, hey, do you want to get drawn? And then I saw and he didn't respond to me. And then he was in Blizzcord. I'm like, yo, do you want to get drawn? And he's like, I was, uh, I was gonna respond. I just need more time. And I'm like, oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, dude. <laughs> he likes to talk in Discord. Uh, Glocked. So Glocked, uh, I also met through Alex Slayer and Jeffrey, but he also talked previously. He changed his Discord uh, profile pic from like this seal to like a Lego guy, and I'm kind of sad because I associate him a lot with that. But I mean, it is what it is. Uh, he's, he's cool though. He's fun to hang out with and stuff. Um, Osin Jin. So Osin Jin is actually a junior moderator. I didn't know that before I did this actually. <laughs> Cause I just knew him as a person that like talked a lot in Blizzcord and did stuff and hanged out with people and it was like well known and he was in like the top 15 or 20 on the leaderboard for people who have talked. But yeah, apparently he's a junior moderator. So it's like, oh. Uh, that makes sense why you why you consistently talk a lot that that yeah <laughs> uh crazy ace king so i actually met him from blocked and jeffrey and alex slayer and gavel and all those people uh he's he's pretty cool i actually don't know him too well but i'm like ah i might as well draw him because i've had interactions with him before and i've like met him because of Discord. so i'm like ah i might as well draw you and I, I really liked, I don't know why, how I drew the hair. Because I'm like, oh, he's crazy. Make it really puffy for some reason. All right, Lavender. So Lavender, I used to hate their skin because previously they were called Jester Dyes. And it was the black and white, like modern Minecraft skin everyone has. And I just I hate those with a passion, those monochromatic, just, oh, they're horrible. Um, but they changed it recently, and I absolutely love it. Thank goodness they changed it. I was going to explode. Uh, Stixler. So I met Stixler through Chris46. He actually makes, uh, Minecraft animations, which are really cool. Uh, he does normal Minecraft SMP stuff, too. But I'm like, oh, another person that does Minecraft animations. That's cool. I only do 2D, though. Uh, but I had a lot of fun, like, playing games with him and hanging out, and he's just a, a hoot and a half. He's good at making jokes and stuff. So, yeah. Storms. So, Storms, I also met through Capital, and <laughs> he was the person we were trying to kill to get the crown, and we failed horribly at doing that, so, <laughs> um... I wasn't actually there during the fight, so he doesn't know any of this. So now he is going to, and, uh, yeah. That's, a. Uh, I drew you art. <laughs> um, Sniff MC. So Sniff MC is actually recommended by Karai. And Karai is one of the people earlier that I mentioned. And there's a lot of people that were recommended by Karai from here because I was having such a hard time finding people to like draw that were in Blizzcord consistently. Like I was starting to scrape the bottom of the barrel to find people. And SniffMC was one of these. When he first found out that I was gonna draw him, he was always like, when am I gonna get drawn? When am I gonna get drawn? <laughs> and it was really funny. Uh, fear five, uh, fire fear, fire fear, fear five, fire fear. I can't read. Um, but Fire Fear is cool, uh, cause, like, I've seen him talk before, not the most. Karai's and Karai, I recommend, he's another one of Karai's recommendations, actually. Um, but bro, literal Minecraft skin is just red. Like, might as well just make him an explosion of fire. It's, <laughs> it's crazy how much red that character has. 
um, L2 and R. So they're another recommendation of Karai. Again, uh, he recommended a lot. Okay, you gotta, <laughs> we got a few more and then we're done. Um, but I actually really ended up liking their character. I would have not expect it at all from them because their profile pic on Discord is just Alistair. It's just Alistair. So I associated Alistair with them. And then I find this female goat. And I'm like, what? <laughs> that was crazy. All right. Uh, Shadrate. Um, theirs was another one. Uh, I I still expected that type of Minecraft skin. Because uh, from their profile. But like that, that made sense. But another one recommended by Karai. This one was the most recommended by Karai. Because I have no idea who they are. But I do know... That they're like a Patreon on Bliss and like not Patreon, but um, server booster on Bliss. So, like, I'm like, okay, well, you're you pay the money, so that works. <laughs> uh, Fish for real, Fish for real was actually a person that would, uh, like kind of just lurked and would be like, oh, that's so cool art and stuff. And then one day he was like, yo, can I get drawn? And then another person was like, yo, can I also get drawn? And I'm like. Ah, I have I have my list filled up. I'm I I will mm. and I actually ended up making a statement being like, hey, I'ma try and draw you, but it depends. And he luckily was able to get in. So Dragon Fruit. Dragon Fruit is an artist and they're cool and I like their art. And like this uh I had I wanted one week where I drew like an artist from Discord. So I don't really know all the artists that I've drawn that well that much, but I wanted I wanted to make sure that that was done cuz just because we make fan art for people doesn't mean we don't deserve our own fan art if that makes any sense. Um Clover. Clover is really cool. They're not officially an artist on Discord, but they post art in the art channel all the time. So I'm like, you need art <laughs> so i drew them art and they they really deserved it and they were really happy and ecstatic about getting the art so i'm very happy that they appreciated it and enjoyed it and they make really like good art so like they deserve it uh flapadoodle so flapadoodle is an artist on blizzcord i've seen some of their art it's cool it's good and i like vc'd with him once and uh, get along that well but like we didn't hate each other so like that's one step above comic <laughs> i don't like comic but um he's really cool i like his little boxer character i thought that was a cool concept all right lumicent so lumicent is like clover where they post art constantly in the art channel and i really like their art they're they're very ambitious with it and while it's not 100 refined just yet the potential in it is like so good it's like this is good art you know it's it's not perfect but it's really good so i really like their art and what they do uh ray likes tofu so ray like tofu <laughs> i don't know them i just they're in art and they and they were in the bliss smp until they weren't and they made a video on it, and it's such a cool video mixing up, like, Minecraft and, like, this 2D pixelated art, kind of, like, Undertale-ish. And it is so well done. I'm like, bravo. Bravo. Because it's really good. Uh, Reshtan. So Reshtan, I, I drew because I just needed a, one more person, any person. I, I, I've seen their art. It's really good. Um, but interacting with them was so great because I'm like, hey, can I draw you? And they were so appreciative of me to for me asking. And we had a little conversation after that. And then once I posted the art, they're like, bro, thank you so much. And so they're just a really great person. I love them. They're so amazing. Uh, me, a cat at much. Um, I drew myself because Karai was like, yo, cat, you should draw yourself. And a few other people that I knew was like, yo, are you going to draw yourself? I'm like, all right, fine, sure, I'll draw myself. So I didn't draw free art for 50 people, only 49. But I, <laughs> I think that's fine, right? I can count myself as drawing free art for myself. I do that sometimes. So <laughs> that's what I did as I drew myself. 
Uh, Pro D4. So he's a bit of a controversial opinion because I know not everyone like considers him a part of Bliss SMP, but not everyone considers him a part of the community. But like he's a mod. He develop. He's the one that develops the 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 add-on for Bliss to make it to, with the gems and stuff. So like he's really important to the SMP, but he's technically not a part of it. So. I'm like, nah, I didn't draw you as a Bliss member, so you're now a community member, and I, now I've just decided that for him, and that, that's what it is now. Uh, thank you guys so much for coming all the way to the end of this video and watching it. Uh, for the last of this, I'm literally just smudging everyone around and transforming them to get them all to fit onto this one small page. I've basically just made an I Spy thing, so like, after you've seen all of this, let me know if you can find specific people in here. Cause like, <laughs> I had a really, I started having a hard time looking at it. Cause I'm like, I can't, they're all blending together. It's just turning into colors. So I basically just made an I Spy page. So good luck finding your own character when I post that. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.